Good morning, Washington Street friends. It's almost Christmas. And I wanna to talk to you about a word that has been in my mind all week long, and it's the word yes. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna to put together a little scene and tell you about how the people in the scene said yes. And so first we're going to talk about Mary. And when the angel went to see Mary and told her that she was going to have a baby and name him Jesus, Mary said, yes. She said she would do that for God. And that word, yes, filled her with so much joy. Mary said, yes. And then I want to talk about Joseph. When Joseph heard that Mary was going to have a baby, he was thinking about, maybe I won't marry her. But an angel came to him in a dream and said, please go ahead and take Mary as your wife because your son will be Emmanuel. He will be the Messiah. And so Joseph said yes. And then Joseph had to go to Bethlehem to register in the census. And he took Mary with him, and they took a donkey to help them along their trip because it was a long, hard journey. And the donkey said, yes, I will help you get there. And then the baby Jesus was born, all because Mary and Joseph said yes. And he was born in Bethlehem in a stable. And Mary wrapped him in bands of cloth and put him in a manger. And so the cow that would eat out of the manger said, yes, the baby Jesus can live there. And then there were some shepherds that were watching sheep in the middle of the night and an angel came to them and said, go to Bethlehem and see the baby. And the shepherd said, yes, we will go and see the baby. And they saw the beautiful Christ child there because they said, yes. And then the wise men saw that there was a star in the sky and they understood the prophecies from the Old Testament, and they knew that they needed to go and see the Messiah. They believed that the Messiah had been born. And so they said, yes, let's go to the stable and bring gifts of gold and frankincense and myrrh to the baby Jesus. The wise men said, yes, we are going to go and worship the new king, the newborn king. And so I wanted to talk to you just for a minute about the word yes, because Mary said yes, and Joseph said yes, and the shepherd said yes, and the wise men said yes. We had a beautiful baby Jesus that we can celebrate each year at Christmas. And there are things that you can say yes to as well. You can say yes to treating others the way that you want to be treated this Christmas time. And you can say yes to loving your neighbor as yourself. And you can say yes to loving God more than anything else in the world because that's the greatest commandment. Let's pray. God, thank you for sending us the baby Jesus and reminding us the importance of saying yes when you ask us to do things like loving our neighbor and treating others the way that we want to be treated. Help us to remember to do this now, through the Christmas season, and forever. Amen.